All right, YouTube and Facebook. This is Miles, and Cayman is running the CRB. I'm showing you his line so far. We're here on our last job of the day, working for a repeat customer. It's actually my second time coming out here. The first time I did it by myself, and he called us back because I walked him through and showed him the whole process, explained everything thoroughly, and he was just really pleased with the whole cleanup. Last time we were here, um, his dog had an accident and tracked it all the way back to this room. I can't. Rem I was taking video, but I think it was on my phone. I'm not sure if I was um, if I saved anything or still have it or anything. But if I do, I'll put that in this video. But let me show you what the carpets are looking like today. We've already pre-treated everything. It's not much light on this side right here, but I want to show you these um, these spots. These are vomit. This one right here and couple more over here actually last time it was uh, some fishies right here from the dog when I had the accident and leaked it over there and I sprayed it and it was foaming up a lot uh, I try to find my best I'm trying to do my best to find that video and put it into this one because it was foaming up a lot good example of what the pet treatment does but I'm about to go ahead and spray this And then we're going to go to the other ones. I've already pre-treated the rest of the room. I just haven't done these spots just so I can take this video for y'all. Okay. And where is the light? Where is the light? I don't know. I do not know. Okay, I guess there's no light. All right, there it is. So I've already treated these. Figured this one will foam up a lot more than this one. Have you run over this spot right here? Where this species was, or this vomit this time. Let's see if it spreads. As we clean all of these carpets, you know, he wrote a good review too, so um, I'll put that review in this video somewhere also. But it's really cool to have a repeat customer, and uh, when you come to their home, they remember you and just build a relationship with your customer. That's something that I love. The Caymans run the CRB. Pull this cord for him. We got all our hoses and everything pulled in right now because it looks like it's about to storm. But you can see how this is foamed up. See around it, everything just soaked down into the carpet, but where the actual vomit was, it's foamed up on top. So that's the peroxide in our serum CU doing the work. And then he's gonna come in here and run the CRB over that to have to take that in and get it down to the fibers. And then we're gonna, this is gonna actually be sitting the longest while we're cleaning in there. And we're gonna come and extract it. This makes some really good video in here just because it's a wide open area. But I'm gonna go ahead and um, put my inline, well, what I don't mean inline, the inline filter is that right there. I need to hook it up, hook up my hose to it. And then once we get started with the cleaning, I'll probably do some recording in the back bedroom, the hallway and um, probably in here, not the living room because it's not too light in there. So I'll see you when we get started with the cleaning.
You remember where that, um, that vomit was? Where was it? I'm guessing right here. It looks a little bit darker. It looks a lot different already. Before you even rinse it. Give me some slack. Might get done with this. I want you to move that fan right here. Alright, down to the last room. This is the sunroom. I've already went around the edges. As you can see, it's like the patch stops right about here. So if I go this way with the wand, the, it won't be flat and it won't be getting suction on this left side. So what I did is just went around, cleaned all the edges. So I just have a, I don't have to stop once I'm recording. So I might just record this whole room. So here you go. see the uh, that vomit is gone. I don't even know where it was. You remember where it was? Not really. <laughs> okay, we said not really. So you hit the serum seed does the trick. So it's a good thing letting it dwell does the trick. This might be the last time y'all see it came in actually. Now that I think about it. 
Uh, he's starting school um, Thursday, I believe. So I don't know if he's going to be working tomorrow. He's learned a lot this summer. We still see him on uh, probably when we do like big commercial jobs on the weekends. He'll probably help on some of those. But it just won't be every day. He won't be working. I just told him he probably won't, this will probably be the last day. How do you feel about that? I don't want to go to school. <laughs> so he don't even want to go back to school. That's funny. What did he say? <laughs> he said until next summer, but little does he know he's going to be working on the weekends on commercial jobs. <laughs> said good. <laughs> he's money hungry. <laughs> Where I did that little corner. Beautiful. We're cleaning at 400 PSI. Okay. Yeah, and rotating the fan as we're cleaning. Go ahead and take that door down. And we're going to take the sealer door down so I can just clean my way up. Keep this video rolling for you.
That's a good cleaner right there. I'm gonna go ahead and um, reel in our hoses. And then we're going to rotate the fan to this and clean up the mat and corner guards that we have down. And I'll see you with the final walkthrough. All right, this carpet's looking a lot better, smell better. Just grooming out my footprints. Work my way out. Vomit the spots are gone. And in here also looks so much better. I'm going to go ahead and finish up with this groom brush. I want to say thank you for watching this video. And be sure to subscribe to the channel if you are not already. And check us out online at wefightdirty.com. And we'll see you in the next one. Well, I will for sure. I don't know about Cayman. He might not be here for the next one. <laughs>